I'm Ali Bozkurt. I was a research fellow quite a long time at Harvard Kennedy School, almost seven years. I'm civil engineer. I made a research about the constitution of the developing countries at Kennedy School. Also, I'm the chairman of a business that we are working in Saudi Arabia, Kuwait, uh, at this time Iraq, Afghanistan, and other Middle East countries. What can accelerate growth in Arab world? Actually, this is the subject that I want to say a few words about that. First of all, in all the countries, the free market economy accelerate the world, accelerate the growth. Dubai is one of the good sample in this region. If you put lots of regulation and government control and stop the moving the people all around, so this stops, this is the most important factor to, to stop growth. If any businessman would like to go to any Arab country, he needs to get visa, he needs to get permission, and he is not allowed to stay there more than three, five days, and this kind of regulations. And also, anything that you import from outside, again, you meet lots of obstacles that stops the growth. Another most important thing is that to move the money, to bring money inside, to take out communication and so many other freedoms, so to say, acting the business are important to really encourage or discourage the growth. The money will not come to a country easily unless they feel safe. If the investors know that they bring the money here in the country, they have to have, first of all, the third world legal access to protect their money. To accelerate the growth needs money, technology, and knowledge. If you don't have all these things, you cannot accelerate the growth. <clears throat> In order to do that, you have to have, you have to give the confidence to the people who are coming to the country to create the job. Beyond the local people who create the job, also, it there has to be some uh, encouragement and initiative for the local people to cooperate with the uh, foreign uh, companies uh, to get the technology and other things. At the end of the world, I would like to say that. As much as you free in working and environment that needs to work, you make a sustainable growth in the country.